Hey, what is up everyone this is Kevin here welcome back again to Tech Kevin YouTube channel Octavi OS official version is out for the Redmi Note 8 users and as yes, this is on the best one based on Android 12 right now for many devices already available i made a video on some devices like Redmi Note 10 Pro and you can give it a try if you want to we are talking about the Octavi OS version based on Android version 12 and Octavi OS version 3.0 which comes with the latest October security patch and i think so this is good because if you compare it with some other android 12 base kits norms it has a very good thing very unique thing which i personally liked a lot i will tell you about that later on so stay tuned for that now moving on to the default things in android version 11 octavio os comes with their own launcher which which comes with some customizations but right now we have this pixel launcher pre-installed but yes we can expect some changes in the upcoming builds but right now yes we have the pixel launcher pre-installed which comes with all the basic features which we get in pixel android 12 and this is the thing which i liked a lot if you have noticed in all the android 12 base rooms right now the quick settings panel or the, this kind of panel is kind of black everywhere yes you can yes you can change the accent color by applying other wallpapers you can see monet engine but still the this ui is kind of white and kind of actual material ui and in my opinion i actually love this a lot this is the only thing and this is one of the best workers rooms i've ever tried right now based on android 12 It also comes with tiles for you, separate tiles for you, Wi-Fi and mobile data, and this is also very, very useful because in custom rooms, other custom rooms, you get this internet tile where you can get the Wi-Fi and mobile data in the same tile. And yes, this is good that you have the Wi-Fi and mobile data, simple, single, single tile. So yes, this is also quite useful in my opinion. Everything else is just kind of same. It doesn't lack any kind of feature from Android 12. Yes, features are already there, but they've included some more things. So yes, improved a lot. And as expected, the Monet engine is also there, which is just working pretty fine. As you just saw, I'm using it. Let me try to apply some other wallpapers and let's see that how this Monet engine is going on right now. We were expecting some good things, but yes, let's try out some wallpapers. I'm gonna try out these art wallpapers, and yes, if you're looking for the wallpaper link, you can simply check out the process. If you move on to this art wallpapers, you will definitely find out this wallpaper. For example, let me try this wallpaper, and let's see if the ASIN color is changing right now. And this is the preview which we have. Yes, as expectedly, it should change. It is changing. I'm applying it to home screen and lock screen right now, and yes, it is applied successfully. You can see the colors are changed. which means the monet engine is just working perfectly fine the quick settings panel has isn't color changed and as you can see the background is still white so yes this is why i just love this thing a lot performance as it seems to be good enough no major issues available here in my opinion so yes you can give it a try if you want to i think so right now this is only the build which you can use in your device as your daily driver the camera section unfortunately do we, we have uh, this uh, snap camera as you just saw that i haven't even opened this because i don't use this camera at all but yes you have the option to use gcam i made a video that you can install gcam on android 12 maybe i made a video on custom home you can give it a try for that gcam that should definitely work that is the only gcam which is working on all most all custom home still now wherever i've tried that this is also one of the major things called safety net status and this is actually a good news Safety status does not have any kind of issues for you. I think so. We'll be able to use banking apps. I'm not sure if you don't install Magisk and safety status will definitely be passed for you or not. But after installing Magisk and after hiding it from settings, yes, that should pass definitely fine. Now let's move on to some other things here. For example, the settings. Of course, they have changed a lot. We have this new profile at the top, about phone and system at the top. The things you always get at the bottom. these are the things there everything else is just kind of same for example let me show you by going into display settings there are no features added as expectedly but yes we can expect some things very very soon now in the system section or if you move the gestures you get the one handed mode you get the swipe to screenshot so this is very useful too i think so you'll definitely use this feature and i don't think so you got this in any android 12 room till now let me show you one more thing for example i think so we have this kind of thing system your tuner that's also there and this is also kind of useful everything else i've already shown you so these were things i just want to let you know if you like this video don't forget to like and share this if you're new here don't forget to subscribe me i'll see you in the next video until then goodbye take care of yourself
feel like I'm floating through the air 